Russian President Vladimir Putin says Russia is armed with an invincible nuclear capable missile. He then turned to a video demonstration showing a potential missile trajectory. It appears to be heading right towards Florida, where President Trump's Mar a Lago estate is. Putin suggesting his nuclear warheads would leave NATO defenses completely useless. It is a claim he was asked about tonight on NBC. Every single weapon system discussed today easily surpasses and avoids an anti missile defense system. But, but you've tested it? The test was excellent. Some of them still have to be fine tuned and worked on. Others are already available to the troops and already are battle ready. For the record, right now, do you have a workable ICBM that's powered by nukes that, that you've tested successfully? All of those tests were successful. It's just each of these weapon systems is at a different stage of readiness. One of them is already on combat duty. It's with troops. Let's discuss now with CNN National Security Analyst General Michael Hayden, the former director of the CIA and the NSA. General, welcome. Thank you. He says these, and I'm, I'm quoting here, they're invincible. Invincible new weapons are battle ready. Is he just yeah. flexing his muscle or is he actually putting the West on notice? So, so I mean, this is important, but, but I, guess, I guess my overall counsel, Don, will be let's not hyperventilate over this. Mm -hmm. What we know for sure is he's got a video game with mediocre graphics that he showed to his parliament today. He's, he's got some weapons that I, I think our Department of Defense knew he was developing, mm -hmm. all right? And, and some of them may be, as he suggested, further along than others. But I don't think any of them, even if they were fully operational, changes the strategic equation, the strategic balance between us and the Russians. We've got to respond. We're going to have to spend money we probably shouldn't have to spend to keep the nuclear balance where it should be.